Hi, this is Vicki Boyd with Rice Farming Magazine. I'm here in Harrisburg, Arkansas, where Rice Tech held a field day at its R&D facility. We caught up with Brian Otis, who's Global Solutions Development Lead, to find out some of the new traits that these hybrids are bringing to the market, just in time for the 2017 growing season. We've got, we've got two new hybrids. One of them will be called RT7311CL. It's a clear field, uh, essentially a clear field version of XP753. And so what it's gonna bring to the table is essentially the same thing you get with XP753 uh, in a clear field platform. And so, you know, we're expecting to see anywhere from 10 to 15% higher yields than 745. Uh, it's going to have the same, uh, well, the same milling quality, maybe a, head, a little bit better on head rice uh, milling quality wise, but uh, otherwise you can expect the same disease resistance and performance with 753 that you would with RT 7311CL. XP769 is uh, uh, some material that we brought out of our South American breeding program. Uh, it's actually a commercial product in South America that we're going to test here on a limited basis. It offers some uh, grain quality characteristics that are more preferred, in the, especially in the Central American market. We feel like it might fit good as an export product. Uh, it's going to have a little bit higher amylose and uh, a little bit longer grain. 